guys, um, welcome back to our channel. It's Mrs. And, no, Mrs. and Mr. Mr. and Miss, Mr. and Mrs. Ayibusi here. Did I say it right? Because, hmm? yeah, apparently I don't know how to say my last name. Hi, guys, it's Mr. and Mrs. Ayibusi here. Yeah, so um, we're here, and obviously, it's been a while because, like, life has just happened to us beyond our control. We've just been adjusting to our newly married life, um, knowing each other, learning each other, and obviously, if you don't know already, we're expecting. She's what? Pregnant? This is just like an update on what we've been doing in that time and then a, um, an explanation of our pregnancy story. Anyway, we weren't planning to get pregnant so quickly, like it wasn't our plan. I think what we initially thought we would do is get pregnant in the next year or so just really really try to find our feet as a newly married couple but obviously God had it other ways and he just blessed us with 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 the fruit of the womb and we're so grateful because ultimately we knew that whatever our plans were God's plans would override so since that last video I actually did have plans to like do more videos and be very consistent and when I watched that video of my newly married experience when I was pouncing around and I was doing cooking this, cleaning this. I didn't I thought my life was gonna be like that forever. Like but I didn't know look one little thing can knock you out of your routine. I didn't I guess I didn't it didn't register to me and pregnancy knocked my whole routine, my whole life. I've never experienced something like that before. How did I find out that I was pregnant? It was not a glamorous story guys. It was not like you know when people do the whole surprising their husband and there's tears and everyone just so happy. Mum was like, what, what is going on with my body? Like, what is, what's going on? Uh, so I missed my period, then I took a pregnancy test. I wasn't going to take a pregnancy test because I was thinking it's going to show up soon. I just felt like I wasn't going to be the kind to get pregnant on my, on my wedding night. I wasn't going to be the type to get pregnant so quickly I knew that just wasn't me what well, I thought that was and I finally took it and yeah it said positive and then I told my husband and then we were just like yeah whose fault is this like what's gonna happen now after this like we, we were just so shocked like raw so yeah it didn't I didn't it didn't happen in the kind where I surprised my husband with the, the steak or you know it, it wasn't like that it was like we were, it was just pure shock it was just pure shock and I think so after that point of finding out my body has just been going through a roller coaster journey like, like the tiredness the nausea the morning sickness the, 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 the heightened senses the mood changes like all of it hits you like, like a ton of bricks and I, I don't know, I just caved in and I was just thinking of what is going on. So and obviously it's like that for a while. So yes, yeah, so obviously I just went MIA because I was just dealing with this new thing that has overtaken me. It's been so intense. I don't know if that's the word. I, like Nobody could have set me up for this. Like no one could have said, this is how it's going to be. And then I, was, I would expect, yeah, yeah, it's going to be like this and then prepare for it no but thank god lo and behold there is a second trimester where it does get better and it doesn't get better straight into your second trimester maybe for some it will but it generally yeah as it as the second trimester progressed i started to feel more like myself and i feel happy and that's why i can post instagram pictures where i'm happy because i'm actually happy so yeah, I feel like, but no one should go and make it out like this is some glamorous, easy experience. For me, it's not been anyway, and I don't want to make it out like that. But yeah, I'm happy, and I look forward to the journey ahead, and I just trust that all is in God's hands. Moving forward, we are going to continue with the channel, and I just feel like we're just going to update 
what's what's going on as we can but i don't want to be like oh we're gonna do it every week or every this every that because then when we don't it's a bit if me and my husband might share something about our lives it's not to show off it's not to paint a picture that's not real it's just to encourage and i feel like with people like all these other superstars that are painting kind of bleak pictures about marriage you do also need an alternative like people who are out there that are actually putting up positive things about marriage that they can aspire to um yeah so expect more videos look out for more videos i'm back to work now it was just a quick update thanks guys bye guys Bye guys. Can you do <laughs> <laughs>